今天我们很荣幸在欧盟电影节这边邀请到了开幕式的电影《三傻西行记》的导演 Yakumi 先生。Hi, Mr. Yakumi. Welcome. It's a real pleasure to have you on the show. It is my pleasure too. Hi. Yeah, could you please, please yeah, introduce yourself a bit more to the audience? Yeah,、um, my name is、uh, Jaak Kilmi. I'm from Estonia. I'm film director, and I'm presenting here my my latest film,、uh, The Dissidents. It's a it's a comedy、mm-hmm. uh, that takes place in in early eighties. That is my favorite favorite、uh, time period. Great, great. Can you tell us why why the you mentioned. Like eighties was your favorite period of time. Is that particular reason behind it? Yeah,、uh, since I、uh, I was、uh, born in、uh, in seventies and uh, mm-hmm. and uh, grew up in uh, uh, in eighties.、Uh, so in eighties, I spent the the. the The lovely childhood and <laughs> uh, and uh, interesting、uh, teenage years. So、mm-hmm. I could say that、uh, I know the eighties because I I kind of grew up in eighties. I see. Good, good. Can you、uh, tell us what inspired you to make this film, the latest film?、Uh, this film is is my. My third、uh, feature, feature film, film、mm-hmm. yes. And all my films、uh, mm, I've made, you know, I kind of、uh, I have I've made them as a time travels because、uh, they all have taken place in 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 past or recent past, like in the eighties, eighties or sixties. Sixties. Well,、uh-huh. One film、uh, took place in in sixties. Uh huh.、Um, So it's kind of.、Uh, I think that、uh, you know when you make a film, it it is、uh, it is kind of interesting、uh, to to absolutely the 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 change the decorations. It it kind of the period、uh, movies、mm-hmm. are kind of you know stage for、uh, for for you know things that th- take place you know. Mm-hmm. But it's it's like decoration. It's like different decoration. When you go to theater, you you also don't want to see the like gr-、uh, the 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 gray reality, but you want to see the decorations.、Yep. You know, that's why the kind of past is kind of decoration for my stories. I see, I see. So that kind of also your your style of、uh, filmmaking.、Yeah. No, it it doesn't concern the style so much because.、Uh, I think that、uh, the way my my actors、uh, kind of act, or the way I direct them, it, it、uh, has nothing to do with the past so much.、Mm-hmm. Um, they're still kind of contemporary films, but but they just take place in past. It took place in the past, but you can relate the story to your to, to the presence, right?、Uh, yeah. So this film actually,、mm, big, uh, it is framed. With the nowadays,、uh, uh-huh. mm-hmm. so it's kind of it starts with the, with, with kind of with this year and、mm-hmm. uh, goes uh, back to to、uh, early eighties, like thirty more than thirty years. Yeah, and then、uh, and then we are again here in 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 our world in our reality. Yeah, so it is kind of、uh, always interesting to see the the kind of the the the, the difference. Great. So, what do you expect the audience to take away from this movie after watching it? <coughs> I, I, I think that the the story, even it, it is you know, situated、uh, in totally different reality, different、like、geographical reality.、Mm-hmm. Uh, it. It is still kind of universal story. The、mm-hmm. uh, um, our for、uh, for the three characters,、mm, three, uh, three main characters, the、uh, the goal they are striving to is you know to to live better life.、Mm-hmm. In this case, in my in the case of my film, the better life,、uh, as they think, waits.、Uh, 
for them in in the West. Mm-hmm. So they go to the West and then they kind of get disillusioned mm-hmm. because you know the reality. The reality uh, and the, the what, what what the thought of the West would be like. Is it, is it gap? Yeah, the, the, the gap uh, between reality and and dreams is is something that. Uh, Uh, usually it's good material for a film. Yes, yes. Good, good. And, it, and it's u- universal because it's like everywhere in the world, you know, lots of people want to get a better life and they have a, a kind of their own illusion or, or their own opinion on the outside world, the Western world. But there is a gap there. Yeah. Uh, so your film can really relate to, to, to that. Yes, mm. uh, but, but uh, what is also um, mm, kind of... Uh, Typical for for my uh, film character is that they all <coughs> very often they are not uh, kind of uh, uh, let's say pure positive characters like like the, these uh, guys uh, the protagonists they are still like small time criminals mm-hmm. and I'm not um, even the the title in 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 uh, in Estonia was heroes mm-hmm. uh, but it was kind of meant meant like heroes so uh, we are kind of making t- jokes of them i see so s- small time criminals become heroes <laughs> yeah so they, they they are kind of treated as heroes but they are uh, not, uh, not not exactly the heroes mm-hmm. uh, they the people you know want to you know see with them yeah not the sti- no the stereotype of uh, heroes yeah so kind of they are most probably their heroes uh, in their life i see so i guess there must be some really um, interesting anecdotes that happened during the shooting of the film right uh, can you share some of the interesting things that happened during the shooting of the film i could say that uh, you know filmmaking uh, very often uh, is uh, is is very uh, constructive uh, and, and uh, you know uh, serious time you, you have this like shooting schedule uh, the days the shooting days are very often too short uh-huh. you just you know try to shoot everything that you need to shoot in that particular day mm-hmm. uh, so it's kind of uh, always you know hurrying 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 Uh-huh. And, uh so and when uh, something unexpected happens then uh, it's 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 usually uh, uh kind, of, uh kind of surprise and usually kind of negative surprise <laughs> yeah so uh, it's, a, it's a challenge for the director it's you always challenge you have to make quick decisions exactly, in this case yeah. exactly and you you have to make compromises oh yeah yeah a lot So, uh, but but in in my case, uh, there were some like, uh, of course, like funny things that you you just uh, uh, later remember them and and and, and laugh. But uh, <laughs> but what uh, what what was difficult difficult was so you know to it, it and it was more and more difficult uh, to make period films uh, in. Uh, mm-hmm. uh, in in our world because the world is changing and all the kind of also the kind of decorations are changing all the yeah. exteriors are changing even the interiors is pretty difficult to kind of reconstruct the uh, uh, the interiors of, of 80s when you yeah. know, people just you know have thrown out all this uh, old <laughs> yeah. stuff and and, uh, and you have to put them back in order to feel exactly, the shoot the film exactly and to wow. find the uh, props Yeah. From 80s to, to find some 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 city corners that still look like 80s. Ah. Oh. You know, it, it it is it is kind of a big challenge. I see. I so see. It, it is definitely easier to make uh, uh, con- contemporary stories yeah. in contemporary environments. So will this kind of change your idea of making some <coughs> maybe films in the future to sh- tell the? Con- I choose to shoot a contemporary film. Yes, um, I, I will. But anyway, I like th- uh, the um, idea that the, the film set is kind of decoration that, that looks different from, from your everyday life. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. So, uh, one of my next films, oh, if, yeah. if, if everything goes kind of as planned, I will shoot uh, in South Asia somewhere. 
mm. in, a, in a jungle. In the jungle. Yeah. So uh, oh. because for 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 your VN film make a jungle is something like very very different and also very exotic and very ins inspiring. Yes. Yes. Wow. So is that kind of a specific genre of films that you are really fond of making? Um, I I like. Uh, light topics, or I, I can uh, I can also kind of I think I can make also film uh, on a serious topic, but uh, but definitely I uh, you prefer I, I always comedies? look I will always look uh, uh, at the bright side of of, of everything light. of life uh -huh. the bright side of everything. So uh, I could imagine that even you're making film about. A kind of tragic topic you can uh, make some funny you can find some funny moments and you bring out some funny moments there se siin olen mina ja see on Mario Viik mu parim sõber tajas meil oma venna kaudu soomlasi välja kes meile virusse lääne kaupa teid välismad teksad sukad suitsud nätsud isegi kilekoti kõik oli siis kõva valuuta selline hangeldamine oli siis muidugi karistatav amatöör vatsailid <laughs> Ei narkotkin, hüüdimi kapp. Peamine oli vast see, et kapi vanematel oli lada. Ma tosse ei ole keda. Need otsad saab maa käieta. Täis sünteetika. Täis pank, me! Täis pank! Vend võeti kinni just! Viidi ära kogu kambaga! Nüüd on nii, võtame paadi ja paneme ise üle lahe minema. Viru juures on nii kellad asjaga. Mida siin mõelda veel on? Tee ära, no! Siin on võik paadikangelased. Tega teil koduigatsus vahevel pole peale tulnud? Kage pee. Töö kindad. Me ei tulnud välismaalt tööle. Võiks nüüd seda Eestis ka teha. Hüppa üle! Peame mingi suure otsa tegema. Pirist! Paista! Paista raule! Mis sa said? Jõu jooki. Dishwashing liquid! Mida tõelse mida asja sa? See on musklite pesemiseks, lol! Can you tell us how much you know about Chinese movies? I've been organizing a film festival in my home country, in Estonia. And... So in recent years I haven't watched that many films, but... But um, I remember from from my earlier years, you know, I always, you know, wanted to see very different films, uh, and always kind of Chinese film or films directed by Chinese directors uh, mm -hmm. have, have been kind of interesting uh, for me because I've, I've been looking for, you know, different mm -hmm. different uh, approaches to to film and to film language. Yeah. So. Um, one big favorite of mine has always yes. been uh, Wong Kar Wai. Wong Jia Wei, yeah, I see. <laughs> yeah. And, uh, but I also like the kind of the, the epic Chinese film uh, Zhang Yimou. Zhang Yimou, yeah. Mm -hmm. This is one of the directors I, I like. Mm -hmm. Yeah, but, 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 but definitely I'm. I'm when I'm uh, in a film festival, I'm, I'm looking for something new. Mm -hmm. So I'm very often I can find the new things, or the interest things in, in, in Eastern films. Hopefully in the future, in the future you will get the, the opportunity to co-produce certain films with Chinese, uh, with Chinese filmmakers. Yeah, sure, yeah. definitely. That would be very interesting. Yeah. The, uh, the, the cultural exchange is always bringing uh, fresh air yeah. to art. And yes, and yes. And, 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 you know, the, the creative people uh, usually, it's very common that, you know, that we are uh, trying to mix the, uh, you know, uh, in our stories, uh, kind of create some kind of cultural conflicts or or cultural mixtures. Yeah, yeah. It, it's something. It brings something fresh. 
Yeah, sure. That's what's also what's interesting about movies to show the different cultural shocks, cultural differences yeah, in the movie. Great, great. And uh, before we finish up here, I know many of our audience are uh, young people. They love to get into movie industry. As an experienced movie you know, maker as you, what advice do you think you can give to, to our Chinese audience? Mm, yeah, I, I remember uh, from, my, from my teenage years that, uh, that I wanted to be part of, of not, not be part of the film industry because I didn't know what is film industry, but I wanted to make films. Mm -hmm. So uh, uh, I could say that the uh, film industry is something that uh, is uh, uh, that that, pro that 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 gives you the chances to live and experience uh, new things, and mm -hmm. kind of the routine is is very different from from the routine, let's say, uh, in, in, a, in a business or in office work. So mm -hmm. Even, you know, there's a lot of office work in the film industry as well. Mm -hmm. But always the kind of... A uh, uh, lot of happens, a lot of happens. It's very adventurous field. Adventurous. You have to be adventurous type to get into the movie industry. Yeah, sure, sure. Because you you need to understand that uh, nothing that everybody everything changes. It's very spontaneous. Mm -hmm. so, uh, you know, not the indus industry is not spontaneous, but but you need you need to get used with uh, changes. With, with, with changes, yes. Exactly. You have to be quick, right? To adapt yourself to the quick uh, changing environment. Ah, exactly, exactly. Thank you so much. This is very valuable advice that you've given to our audience. Uh, any other words you'd like to say to the movie Chinese, your movie viewers in China before we finish up here? Um, I'm, I'm very uh, excited uh, to, to pre present my film in China. I must say that uh, when I made this film, I never, actually, I never imagined me presenting this film in China because. Uh, uh, you know, th th it, it, this kind of uh, story that uh, is closely related with with my past in my country, but but uh, it makes me very happy that uh, I could bring this film to the wider audience internationally. Great, great. We hope more audience, more people will get the chance to watch your film and they'll appreciate it. Thank you so much for taking the interview and giving us all the valuable advice. Yeah, it's a real honor. Thank you. I wish you all the best.